So in this video today, I'm going to talk about how now you've got the grip, got the setup, how you take the club away for the first few feet. And this is a very crucial area. There's quite a few different ways we could uh, come at it, but I'll just give you one really good uh, way to do it, especially at home. Have an alignment stick and just put it onto the back of the shaft here, back of the club just so it's an extension of this club. This is the, one of the best drills. And what you want to have when you set up, be touching the side here. And what you're gonna be doing is, as you take the club back, keep this touching the side here. So as you take it back, it's still touching. So you don't wanna go this way, pull the club inside, and then this will come outside. And you don't want it to come too much down down your left eye too early too. So keep it there for a little bit. It'll start to move down slightly. And then as you get past the first foot and a half or so, then it'll start to slide down as you start cocking your wrists this way. But definitely keep it touching to the left eye till just before it gets to parallel. When it gets to parallel, it'll start to come out. But just before then, especially this first couple of feet, just past it 45 degree angle here keep it touching just like that another drill same thing but this time using what is called a tour rotation stick trs made by an old friend of mine liam bond he was the designer i highly recommend it it's got a little flex to it and it doesn't make a noise if you hit full shots with it so i definitely recommend this so you can set up with that, plus you can set up with a regular grip. You don't have to hold a stick in your grip. So you've got the regular grip there. Same thing, stuck to your side, just keeps touching, then starts to go down your left thigh to about here. So from this angle, you can see it touching my side again. Keep it touching, keep it touching. Goes down the left thigh, then eventually it will come off once it gets to parallel to the ground. So this is a really good one. Just keep doing this movement here. Keep it touching. And then you're in great position moving back. So you don't get the hands. This is the biggest thing I see with most players is because the weight of the club's there, it stays close to the ground and this starts coming out. You want to start to feel like the club's being picked up a little bit here. And this keeps touching and then starts to go down your left thigh.